it was, um, oh, let's think, one, seven, nine, oh, come on! How did Samantha even come up with that? Stashing away my sweets in our safe! Oh, I'll show her! I'll love it end! Sam, stop! What now? Is that Samantha's safe? Yes, but there's... If Samantha put something in her safe, you can't touch it! That's the rule! And if I put something in a safe, she won't touch it either? Of course! Oh, I like that. Susie, will you please help me make my own safe for coins? For coins? Yes! Samantha keeps pinching my coins that I'm saving for candy! Huh, well, it'll only be fair. I think I have some cardboard left. Let me check. <laughs> quick! Quick! I need… Oh, hey there. Sue and I are going to make a safe. And my coins will be safe inside! It won't just be safe, it'll be interesting too. Interesting? How? We'll make a piggy bank that will swallow the coins. Swallow? Well, as long as it doesn't digest them, then I can get it back. So what do I do? Put out circles? Make decorations? Chop some sticks? Hot. <laughs> Sammy, calm down. Let me think. Oh, yes, you can cut the sticks since you're such a pro. No problem, though. All right, and I'll start with the cardboard. As usual, we'll make some base details first. I'll need a few parts with holes. Remember to be careful with the cutter. And the cut must be precise. Take your time. Like this. I'll glue these three parts together. <laughs> I believe I've become an expert when it comes to hot glue. Of course, always use caution. And when cutting sticks, too! I didn't even cut myself. That's great! Are well, you making a frame? No, Sammy. It's a future mouth for your coin-hungry bank! Oh, carry on! I'm intrigued. Right on! There will be a small hatch in the bottom. Cool! This tiny door works great! Now I'll put together a frame for the bank. I'll make it out of these rectangular parts. It's very simple. I just need to remember to leave some space on each side. Let's see if it fits. <gasps> Looks good! No need to glue this. It'll be a moving part. But now, it'll help us to understand where to glue these parts. Very careful. I don't want to glue everything together. Just attach these narrow strips to the wall. The first batch of sticks is ready! Just in time, thank you! You're welcome. These little sticks will go on top of the moving part, right here on the sides. One. And two. And also onto these parts. Double check. Yep. Everything fits perfectly. Now… And the rest! You're so fast, Sammy. I'll need these really soon, in a few moments. I'll just glue the back wall. And I… And you will bring me a piece of twine. Yes, ma'am. Like this? Exactly like this. Let's put together the moving mechanism. Securely wrap the thread around the stick. Glue the stick to the moving part. Pass the thread through this part that was made by Sammy. I did it myself because there was no need for hot glue, just this wood glue! Well, I'll still need hot glue because we need this part to be securely attached to the cardboard. One circle, two circles, and an all! Uh, what? We need to make another part out of circles with a hole in the middle. Guys, this all is very sharp. Be careful with it. I'll put three circles together on the all. Two big ones and one smaller one. Oh! How did you know that's the glue I needed? I read your mind. Huh? <laughs> oh, guys, do you think Sam can read minds? You never know what slimes can do. I might have missed something. But I do know what step is next. I'll insert a skewer into this part that we made. And secure it with glue. Like this. I'll also need a similar part but bigger. And a cube made out of cardboard squares. This part with a small stick and a small circle. What are they for? Hmm, what about reading my mind? You know, the conditions aren't the same. Magnetic storms. <laughs> I see. I'll put together a revolving mechanism out of these parts. These parts made of small circles will go here. And the parts made of larger circles and the cube will go there. Awesome! 
should the thread just dangle like this? Right, Sammy. We'll attach it to this small stick. Let's tighten it. And secure it with glue, just to be safe. And cut off the excess. That magnetic storm is gone, and I see... I see you need rubber bands! You're right, Sammy. Two rubber bands will go inside. I'll use tweezers to expand them and avoid breaking something. Let's see. Oh, yes! It works! Excellent! <laughs> and there'll be one band outside here. Don't forget this part! I won't, of course! It's a handle to make the rotating more convenient. I'll secure it with glue. And check! <sighs> Good job! Something's missing, though. One more wall and a bottom? Those two, but wait right here! I'll be back! Okay, meanwhile, I'll attach these parts. That's it! Your saving bank is ready, Sammy! You can't deliver the finished work without my decorations! Oh, okay, okay. I'm sorry, Sam. I've prepared everything. Move. Okay, th this one here, and uh-huh. Yep. Oh, oh, oh! That one, too! Done. That's a real coin eater. Coin eater? Oh, I like that. Come on, let me put my coins inside, quick! Yes, and if you need them yourself, you can take them out through this hatch here. But shh, don't tell Samantha. I won't. Do you guys want a bank like this for yourselves? Give a thumbs up and go make it. And get your friends to make it more fun. Hey guys, if you want to get to know me a little bit better, comment below and we'll tell you even more funny stories of my life. And uh, while you're doing that, we'll show you another cool thing. Phew, what a day. I need to lie down for a few minutes to regain some energy. Huh? What's this? <gasps> How did they get here? Huh, I need to ask Sam. Huh? Oh! Looks like our house is gradually turning into one big coin box. Sam, we need to talk. <laughs> What's all this? Oh! You found my coins! Yay! I know these are coins, but what are they doing under the pillow and in my shoe? Uh, I forgot to warn you that I'm saving money for a super purchase! Saving money in my sneakers? Those are my hiding spots! But there's a problem. The problem is that those sneakers are not a coin box! No! I keep forgetting where I put the money. I think I know how to help you. <laughs> Come on. I suggest making a money bank for your coins. Then you won't forget where you put your savings. Ugh, no! Money banks are so boring! Old-fashioned. Um, I haven't finished yet. It will be an automatic money box. And very fun. Will it automatically steal my money? <laughs> Almost. Will it automatically give my money back? If it gives you your money back, you will never have the sum you need. Perhaps you're right. Now we need to draw an outline on the cardboard. To draw some teeth. Did I hear right? You're drawing teeth? You mean this toothy money box will munch my coins? Oh, don't forget that these are cardboard teeth. They're drawn. Does it matter? These jaws look fearsome like a shark. <laughs> Up, um, a little bit more. There. Ew, it looks scary! 
Don't worry, it's your future money box. The toothy guy can rest for now, and I'm going to need this lid. That's where the money will fall. I'll unscrew the lid for now and insert the plastic piece into the box, right into this opening. I need to screw it in carefully. And put the lid back on. Perfect. See? Hey, Sam, could you please help me cut out these pieces for the teeth? Sure, sure. I knew you couldn't do without me. To make the teeth snowy white, we won't paint them. Just glue some paper over them. Take them! Quickly! Before the glue dries out! Carefully now. And repeat on the other side. There. <laughs> this smile is as white as a toothpaste commercial. Pour my can of shark! Now we're going to repeat the trick with paper. And we'll cover the whole box with green paper. Be careful with the corners. It's best to use self-adhesive paper here. Go nice and slow to avoid any bubbles under the paper. You didn't say which size the eyes should be. That's why I cut out a lot of them. Oh, these will do perfectly. Yes, <laughs> they look great. They look kind of evil. Well, it'll have to scare strangers away from your treasures. So I think it's just the right look. This won't do. Let's make stands from cardboard. They'll keep our money box stable. And there. Perfect, see? Sue, can I make a toy for Fluffy out of this thing? Oh no! We need this thing for our money box. I'll get something else. Now we can start making the mechanism for our automatic money box. I need to bend this wire a few times. Be careful with pliers, guys. It needs some effort. This is what we get. Now I need to secure the wire inside the money box in the openings I made in advance. There you go. Aha! Looking good. Guys, I hope you're watching my videos attentively. If you do, watch this video to the end and write how many coins I used in this video. Sam, that seems like a difficult task. I'm sure our viewers can do it. Now comes the most interesting and difficult part. First, I'll draw an outline on this wooden stick. No ruler needed. Oh, I almost forgot. I need to make an opening. Ask an adult to help you with the drill. There. Be careful! <laughs> Why are you wearing glasses? To stay safe, of course. Oh, let's attach this piece to the motor. Great! Now let's start assembling. I'll remove this piece so it won't get in the way. But we'll need it later. And I'll glue the cardboard base here. It'll hold the motor with the wires. Carefully now. And... There. Perfect. It should look like this. Where am I going to throw my coins? Into the mouth? We'll make a special arm. A money box with arms and teeth? Oh no! I'll need these two cardboard pieces and also these half circle pieces of foil with wires attached to them. And we need to put them together like this. This is the money receiver we made. And moving on to the arms. I'll measure 4.5 centimeters on these wooden sticks. Now we really do need the ruler. <laughs> And I'll make a cut. Not actually a cut. I'll use a file for that and make a dent. Not all the way through, see? And you get this kind of bend. I'll apply some glue along the bend to make it sturdier. Could you make these for me as well? What for? Well, I don't know. I'll scratch Fluffy with them. <laughs> I'll think about it. Let's assemble our machine now. One arm. And the other one. Just put them on the wire. There. I should secure it with glue. Just in case. And now it's time to attach the coin receiver. Don't be shy with the glue. It should hold really well. And I think it looks good. 
Let's hide all of these wires inside the box. One. Yeah. Whew. Working with wires can be difficult, but the results are totally worth it. And the other one. Nice and slow. We need to add an accumulator to make our mechanism work. There. We only need to connect it now. Huh. There are so many wires in here. Huh. Let's see. Look! I decorated our money box with these ridges! Now it's even more fearsome! No thief will dare touch Sam's coins! And I also connected all the wires inside the box. Now I only need to cover all the insides with cardboard. We have to make sure the coins don't fall inside. Some glue should help secure it. But not too much. Yes! Perfect! And I need to attach the arms to the wires! on both sides. Done! Hey, Sam, come give this money machine a try! Coming! Oh! Oh, <laughs> let me try. <gasps> yeah, it works! Do it again! I'll start with the smallest one. <laughs> awesome! More. Yay! Oh, this is so cool! Wow! And the biggest one! Yes! Now three small ones. Wow! Awesome! Okay, two middle-sized ones. And… <gasps> oh, amazing! Oh, let me try! <laughs> Guys, if you liked our video, give a thumbs up. Not only will you support Sam, but also that will help millions of other kids around the world discover our channel and fall in love with it just as much as you. And now, let's get started with the next craft. Wow! I just… I need this thing! I'll go check. Uh… Wait, there's nothing to check there. <laughs> right, right, Susie! La da 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 so, what's the problem? I'm sure you've saved lots of money in your coin boxes. No. I spent all that already. But, Sammy, coin boxes exist for saving money for a very important thing. You can't keep taking money from them. Ugh, sure you can. It's so easy to take money from them. Huh. What would stop you from taking money from a coin box? Well, if the money were guarded by someone… Someone fearsome. <gasps> like the Hulk! Hulk? Hmm. You know, I think I can help you. Will you please give me money for my dream purchase? No, Sammy. But I'll help you save money for it. Come on. Hi, guys. Do you know how to save money to buy things you dream of? I'm sure they do. Not everyone is such a spender like me. <sighs> Sammy, cheer up. You can simply learn how to save money. And I hope that Hulk will help you with that. Uh, Susie, maybe I don't know much about saving money, but I know for certain that that isn't the Hulk. Not yet. But you'll see soon. All right, tell me how I can help you. Huh. You can bring me a skewer. A skewer? I can bring ten! Well, I don't need ten, but all right. Guys, today we're going to make a funny coin box that looks like the Hulk to help Sam learn how to save money. To make the front panel, we need this piece with round openings. And these two half frames, I think. <laughs> they are made of two similar parts. We need to glue them together. Remember to be very careful when you work with hot glue. And… Press! Sue, I got it! 
What if you start paying me for helping you with crafts? That will help me save money. Ah, uh, what? Oh, I see. It's a bad idea. I'm off to look for skewers. Oh, that's slime. Well, all right. We'll continue. We need to glue this strip of cardboard between these pieces. Like this. And now we're going to need this piece of cardboard covered with white paper. Just place it in. Like this. No need to glue it. But we'll need to glue these two pieces on top. It's a kind of a hiding place for that white piece. <laughs> uh, Susie, it's… Uh... I see. A broken skewer. What happened? Can you imagine it? I was walking. And then Cookie came. And then Fluffy. And Tater Tots. And… And… Oh, I see. You've had an adventure. Yes. Fine, we'll deal with it in a bit. And meanwhile, we made this opening between the parts. It's very important, and soon you'll see why. Yahoo! Sammy! <laughs> I asked you to bring rubber bands, not play with them. <laughs> but I made you laugh. I'm very useful. No arguing with that. Right. We need to glue these two rubber bands here. Right in the middle into the opening we made earlier. See? Like that. I see everything. Sam, you'd better bring some skewers. I've calmed all of our animals. They won't bother you. Fine. <laughs> While Sam is away, I'll show you one funny thing. Look! <laughs> I'm sure that this will stop Sam from taking the coins. If you agree, give a thumbs up. Okay, let's set this aside. And take several cardboard circles. One more. There. Now I'll make an opening for the coins. Using a coin as a template. Aha! There. And now let's cut it out. Be careful with the cutting tools. Watch your fingers! It looks like a bitten cookie. Huh. Yeah, it does a bit. I see you brought some skewers. A whole three of them. I would have brought more, but there aren't any left. I'll need only one. And these circles make a cardboard sandwich. Listen, are you making a coin box or cooking here? A coin box, don't worry. I'll skewer the circles like a kebab. See, I told you. <laughs> well, what can I do if I get all these food metaphors in my head? Oh, I think I'm hungry. One moment. All right. Uh, uh, aha! Sammy? Hiya. Yeah. I thought I should help you, so here. Huh. Well, actually, it's what I need. Here's your reward. Oh, eat cheese yourself. <laughs> I will. I can't only eat candies. So even though Sam added his hand to my craft, he did it right. Look, this is the piece we need here. Now let's glue the walls. One wall goes here. And the other goes there. Great! So where's my skewer? Oh, there you are. We need to insert it into the wall. Carefully. And secure it with glue. You need to make sure everything is even and neat. So take it slow. Susie, I've been thinking. If it's the Hulk, then we're going to need green paint. Wow, Sammy. You're so shrewd today. But no, we won't need the paint. It's like that, huh? First you want to poison me with cheese and you're calling me names! <gasps> Sammy, Sammy, wait! Oh, guys, please subscribe to the channel to support Sam. I don't want to offend him. Well, if they subscribe, then fine. I'll forgive you. <sighs> so, uh, how's it going? Well, check it out. The mechanism is ready. We only need to glue a few more pieces. How will you make the cardboard green if you're not using paint? Well, that's one way to do it, but… Wait, don't tell me! I want to see it in action! Alright, deal. And there. Now we only need to make the handles and decorate it. Hmm, let's see… And… Ta-da! There! We glue two circles together and stick black tape around to make it prettier. Hulk not like pretty! Hulk like useful! Oh, really? Who was going to paint here? That wasn't to make it pretty. It was to make it look like Hulk! Oh, I see. Well, like I said, we won't paint. 
we'll make something more interesting. Yahoo! Look, Sammy, we're going to use these stickers instead of paint. Much easier. Awesome! They look like the real thing! I'm glad you like it. Then let's go. First, the face. Oh, did you really have to make his mouth so scary? Well, that's what the Hulk looks like, right? Right, but… So we need to cover the box with stickers at the back, on top, and on the sides. Oh, that's quite scary already. Well, that was the whole point, right? Oh! <laughs> I'll add an arrow to the handle. There. And this is the door for the coins to take them out when you need them. It's done, Sam! Uh, that's great, Julia. I… I think you can keep it. Oh, why? Let's put your savings in it. Here we go. Uh, oh. Here we go. And turn. <laughs> Let's do more. Spin, spin, spin. Okay. Sam respect Hulk. Sam not take coins without asking. Well done, Sammy. And when you do want to take the coins, ask me. We'll do it together. I'm sure the sum will be enough to fulfill your dream. To fulfill my dream. Yay! Uh-oh. I'll go daydream away from here. <laughs> do you guys like this coin box? Give a thumbs up if you do. And see you soon!